the part that I love the most about mixing is the creative aspect of it. For me, that means sense, reverbs, delays, all those effects that you can automate, you can add to spice up your mix. Today I want to show you a technique that is not new, but recently I've started using it in a different way, just to add that final creative enhancement to my mixes. Left out, I know how they feel, but I got your back like a weight belt, and I never buy what they sell, cause I just can't do fake well. The winner feeling like I can't go any further. I know someone got my back when my vertebra lines are blurred a lot, whether I'm hurt or not. I don't worry about it. I'm happy with how the mix sounds, but I feel it's a bit too static, and I feel that we can improve on this a lot. Five years ago, I had a video about the lazy delay throw, where you have an audio track with some effects. And this is what I have here. I have five tracks with different effects. I have a buildup where I have transit, a delay, distortion, wide, and a reverb. The technique is quite simple. You just take a piece of the audio and you just drag it wherever you want on the effect track. This uh, type of workflow is so much better than just using regular sends and automate everything. For me, it makes more sense to use it like this. I have the delay and let's uh, build some uh, delay throws. Left out, I know how they feel, but I got your back like a weight belt and I never... I want a delay right here. Left out, I know how they feel, but I got your back like a weight belt and I never buy what they sell cause I... One thing that you should be careful of when you are dragging a mono track onto a stereo track in Studio One, it will change the format to mono. Let's uh, put it back to stereo. Left out, I know how they feel, but I got your back like a weight belt and I never buy what they sell cause I just... Left out, I know how they feel, but I got... Back like a weight belt and I never buy what they sell Cause I just can't do fake well The winner feeling like I can't go any further I know someone got my back when my vertebra lines are blurred I know someone got my back when my vertebra lines are blurred a lot Whether I'm hurt or not I don't worry about it and I just turn to God Left out I know how they feel But I got your back like a weight belt And I never buy what they sell Cause I just can't do fake well The winner feeling like I can't go any further I know someone got my back when my vertebra lines are blurred a lot Whether I'm hurt or not I don't worry about it and I just turn to God Left out I know how they feel But I got your back like a weight belt And I never buy what they sell Cause I just can't do fake and this is the basic lazy delay throw that I've showcased a couple of years ago. We can take this a step further and add different effects. This sparks my creativity in a different way than just using regular sands and automating them. Since you can visually see the events on the track, you can process that effect in a more intuitive way. I have this called build up and it's a uh, transit from uh, baby audio what i want to do is add a transition with the beat on the last uh, section let's say this section the power of this technique is that you can do fades really quickly without having to automate things Go any further, I know someone got my back when my vertebra lines are blurred a lot, whether I'm hurt or not. I don't worry about it, and I just turn to God. And just like that, we have a build up effect with the beat. Belt and I never buy what they sell, cause I just can't do fake well. The winner feeling like I can't go any further, I know someone got. Let's try adding the vocals. Two on this track. I just can't do fake well. The winner feeling like I can't go any further. I know someone got my back with my verse. I like it. Let's uh, duplicate the track. Let's add the final part of the vocals. Just like that. Let's uh, process the vocals in a different way. Let's make that uh, a bit more wider and add a doubler and I'm muting the direct uh, signal and let's lower it in the mix. 
Feeling like I can't go any further I know someone got my back when my vertebra Lines are blurred a lot whether I'm hurt or not I don't worry about it and I Then I just turn to God Doubt I know how they feel But I got your back like a weight belt And I never buy what they sell Cause I just can't do fake well And when I'm feeling like I can't go any further I know someone got my back with my vertebra Lines are blurred a lot whether I'm hurt or not I don't worry about it and I just turn to God Left out I know how they feel But I got your back like a weight We have some distortion they fell but i got your back like a weight belt and i never buy what they sell because i just can't do fake well the I know how they fell, but I got your back like a weight belt, and I never buy what they sell, cause I just can't do fake well, and when I'm feeling like I can't go any further, I know someone got my back, when my friend doubt, I know how they fell, but I got your back like a weight belt, and I never and what we can do now is change the effect even more, let's uh, change the format with a uh, little alter boy, and we can create a nice difference between the effect and the lead vocal. Left out, I know how they feel, but I got your back like a weight belt, and I never buy what they sell, cause I just can't do fake well. The when I'm feeling like I can't go any further, I know someone got my back with my vertebra lines. Are... Let's add a reverb, a plate. Let's go with Valhalla plate. They been left out, I know how they feel, but I got your back like a weight belt, and I never buy what they sell, cause I just can't do fake well. The when I'm feeling like I can't go any further, I know someone got my. Let's go even crazier, add ensemble to make this really wide. Doubt I know how they feel, but I got your back like a weight belt, and I never buy what they sell, cause I just can't do fake well. The when I'm feeling like I can't go any further, I and let's blend it better. Something like this. And left out, I know how they fell, but I got your back like a weight belt, and I never buy what they sell, cause I just can't do fake well. The when I'm feeling like the last section, let's make it wider with this wide track. Let's drop this down. And here I have face modulator from uh, Valhalla with a flanger. Again, make sure that the track is stereo. Just can't do fake well. The when I'm feeling like I can't go any further. I know someone got my back when my vertebra lines are blurred a lot. I like the effect, but let's make it a bit more darker. Let's put this before. Too fake well. The when I'm feeling like I can't go any further. I know someone got my back when my vertebra lines are blurred a lot. Whether I'm hurt or not, I don't worry about it and I just turn to God. Left out, I know how they feel, but I got your back like a weight belt and I never buy what they sell. Cause I just can't do fake well. The when I'm feeling like I can't go any further, I know someone got my back when my vertebra lines are blurred a lot. Whether I'm hurt or not, I don't worry about it and I just turn to God. Left out, I know how they feel, but I got your back like a weight belt and I never buy what they sell. Cause I just can't do fake well The when I'm feeling like I can't go any further I know someone got my back when my vertebra lines are blurred a lot Whether I'm hurt or not I don't worry about it and I just turn to God Left out, I know how they You can have a lot of this audio tracks with effects on them And you can just drag and drop pieces of audio And just try and get creative as much as possible Experiment and see what you like One thing that I love doing is save the sense that I like from different tracks and you can make a template that way. For example, let's uh, delete this. Let's say that we have our mix. It's time to get uh, creative. One thing that you can do after you have your template, you make a new project, you save all of your sounds that you like on audio tracks. Then you go to song, import song data, import the sounds, just like this. And now we have our sense. This is such a powerful technique that I've been using lately. I like the workflow much better than just using sense. It's visual, it's hands-on, just drag and drop audio pieces, audio events on new tracks. You don't have to go through menus. If you don't like, let's say, a delay throw, you just move the audio piece to the next uh, delay that you have and the possibilities are endless. You can even send 
those audio tracks to other sends and create really complex effects. I hope that you enjoyed this video. If you did, don't forget to subscribe, drop a like. If you have any questions, leave a comment down below. Thanks for the support and see you guys really, really soon. Cheers.